Hello everyone, I hope you are having a great day. Before we continue with our video today, I want to warmly thank everyone for supporting our channel and inform you that we will continue to work and improve our content. Without further ado, let's move on to today's video. HBO Max and DC Comics announced the new animated film Aztec Batman, Clash of Empires, inspired by Mexico. It was during the framework of the Guadalajara International Film Festival, FICG, when the new project was presented, which will be strongly related to Mexican culture. One of the goals of the different streaming platforms found in Mexico is to innovate and offer content that is more nationalistic and attached to Mexican culture, which is why, in an unprecedented collaboration, HBO Max and DC Comics announced their most recent animated production, the which will tell the story of the conquest of Tenochtitlan with the stellar participation of Batman. It was within the framework of the Guadalajara International Film Festival, FICG, when the new project by Warner Brothers Animation, Particular Crowd, and Anima Studios was presented and which will star the protector of Gotham City in a version inspired by Mexico and the which will be called Aztec Batman, Clash of Empires. Marcelo Tamburi, content development leader for Warner Media in Latin America, announced that said animated film production will reach the HBO Max platform. It is announcing the start of production of a movie based on DC characters for HBO Max. The truth is, for fans and non-fans, having a Mexican Batman is a source of pride, he said in a meeting with the media. According to a synopsis provided by Variety, in this one we will have the story of Yowali Kotal, who is the son of Tolta Katzen, leader of the village. After being killed by Spanish conquistadors, the young man goes to Tenochtitlan to warn King Moctezuma, where he ends up training and developing combat gear at the Temple of Tzinikin, the Bat God. The film will be developed entirely in Mexico and will be supervised by Alejandro Diaz Barriga, an expert in Mesoamerica and ethnic groups in Mexican culture, and will also be directed by Juan Meza Leon, who has also worked on the animated series Harley Quinn and Rick and Morty. At the moment, the film does not have a tentative date for its premiere or the cast that will give life to the voices, but it is anticipated that various national talents will join the project that will soon bring a Mexican Batman version to the screens. Animated This is only the preamble to countless productions that are prepared for the Latin American public, as revealed by Luis Duran, CEO of HBO Max Latin America, who in a past interview with Variety commented that the idea is to produce just over 50 special productions before of 2023. It should be remembered that this will be the second production of DC Comics and Warner Brothers with another streaming company, Spotify, that has national participation in its ranks and that directly alludes to the Joker's nemesis. And it is that it was at the beginning of May when the podcast Batman Unearthed was released, which has the participation of the renowned Mexican actor Alfonso Herrera, who gives voice to the iconic hero in his version for Latin America. On the other hand, this is not the only national participation, since Carlos Aragon gives life to the voice of Alfred, Ana Brenda Contreras as Barbara Gordon, Alfonso Borbala as El Acertijo, Hernan Mendoza as Thomas Wayne, and Zuria Vega puts on the shoes of Kill. According to the synopsis, the new production will feature the villain The Harvester, a serial killer who stalks the city in the face of Batman's unexpected passivity. For some reason, Bruce Wayne doesn't remember his role as the Dark Knight and works as a medical examiner at a Gotham hospital run by his father, Dr. Thomas Wayne. Therefore, Barbara Gordon must enlist the help of Enigma to find the killer and find out what is going on with the Cape Crusader. The story was written by David S. Goyer, who has developed scripts for both comics and movies such as Zack Snyder's Batman vs. Superman, Dawn of Justice, or Christopher Nolan's multi-award winning film, Batman, The Dark Knight Rises, performed by Christian Bale. 
Thank you for visiting our channel about comics and pop culture. Subscribe to Uncanny Collectibles for more exclusive information, news, and scoops. Thank you.